come on the candle right, board. Um. What's up guys? Welcome back to another hair tutorial. It's your boy Quez and thank you for always watching my videos. If you're a new subscriber here, thank you for subscribing. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for always watching. Hit your bell notifications to keep up when I'm posting new videos and also follow my other social media platforms listed down in my description box below. In this tutorial, I won't really be talking much. I just want y'all to get into how I freaked this frontal messy updo with some old hair. Yeah, this girl done brought me in some old used up hair, but she my girl and she know I transform something out of nothing. Now let's get into it. She turned right So I went in with some rice water from Miel's and now I'm just taking my blow dryer and blow drying her hair out. Now that her hair is all dry, I'm just running my flat irons through it, just doing one pass so I'll be able to put product on it and be able to slick it up for when I want to put it into a ponytail.
So now I'm just freezing her hair back, pushing everything out of my way because I'm about to lay this frontal. Look at this frontal, you guys. You see, as you can see, this frontal has been used previously. And um, we're about to tweak it. I'm about to tweak it and lay it maybe like an inch or two of, in front of her hairline. You're not going to put the frontal on her hairline because you want to save their edges. As you can see, she still has her edges and um, we want to keep them. So yeah, I'm about to lay the frontal. I'm going to put the glue maybe an inch or two in front of her hairline so that we're not taking away any of her hair. Right here, I'm adding in some tracks just to give like the seamless ponytail look. I'm still gonna end up adding tracks around the ponytail, but I just wanted to add in some tracks just to give it a little more fullness because her hair was a little more finer once we pressed it straight. So I just wanted it to look a little more fuller within the ponytail. And I'm just double checking to make sure no tracks are showing, pulling her hair up in the ponytail to make sure everything is seamless and you're not able to tell that no tracks were added. And then I'm going back in and adding another layer of glue. So we are able to lay this frontal down and get this thing going.
So I'm going to lay the frontal and just hot comb everything back out of my way so I'm able to see what's going on, what I'm working with. Taking my got to be spray and just freezing his hair up, making sure that everything is in place. Now it's time to mold the frontal up into the ponytail so that it'll blend with her natural hair. Here I'm just taking my tweezers and just removing some bulkage out of the bangs. Just 
Corners in the pad, they get my piece. I'm pushing P. Cop new hammers for my P. We don't want no P. Got a spot across the spot. To the peace. Drop the battle, now we plotting. We got the keys. She not a lesbian for P. She turned pimpian. Push P. I'm pushing P. I'm capital P. I write the president. I'm president. Push P. P's on her knees. My banana P. She let me squeeze and she leave. Cause she keep me P. Privacy, privacy. Bitch, I'm pushing P. Now this is the part I'm going to add tracks around the ponytail just for more fullness so that when I pin the hair up it'll look just pretty much effortless like you know we just wrap the hair up without having to add any tracks in there Now I'm taking my small flat iron and just doing some small spiral curls. And now I'm just about to see how I'm going to pin it up. So I'm just taking all the hair and just gathering in, just seeing how I'm going to pin it. And seeing how she likes it or want it pinned up. Much way. 
and that's it guys this concludes this hair tutorial i hope you guys enjoy watching how i laid my girl to rest she was just going for something you know pretty clean and effortless for her birthday you know didn't take much to really accomplish this look i hope you guys really enjoy like share comment below hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribing and i thank you guys for tuning in and see you in the next video Can't even sit in peace Cause all of these niggas be on you